I'm a passionate guy. I love people with passion. You ever been around a person with no passion? I checked into this hotel and a woman named Hope checked me in. Big old smile. She said, how you doing? And I love the Gaylord Properties. First time I was ever to Gaylord Property was in Nashville at Opryland. They assigned a person to take me into my room. I said, and you are? He said, my name is Jeremy. I'm in celebrity services. I said, what do you do? He said, I escort all celebrities to their rooms. I said, Jeremy, who am I? He said, permission to speak freely? I said, absolutely. He said, I don't have a freaking clue. His management told me to take you to your room. <laughs> but I checked in there last night, old Hope, like, how you doing? I said, I'm doing good. You ever check in a hotel and have them say this? Seriously, they're behind the front desk. I love when they say stuff like this. You have a reservation? <laughs> no, no, no. I flew from Charleston to Charlotte, and, and then I flew to Dallas, and, and then I got a taxi, and I came over, and, and, and then I brought my luggage in um, <laughs> just to say hi to you. I had a kid one night at Taco Bell down in Lubbock, Texas. He's like, yes. And he watches me come in, and I'm, I'm doing the maze. You know, they got the maze up. They didn't take it down. There's nobody in the... Hey, get ready for this. Hey, next time somebody calls payroll, next time they call you, answer the phone like this, like this kid. Sup. I said, what's up? He said, you need something. I said, I don't want a beef burrito, but I'm worried. He said, about what? I said, I don't think you got the energy to pull it off. <laughs> you know what he said next? How many ever worked around a person in payroll that said they're burned out? Come on. <laughs> next time somebody says they're burned out, you tell them what I told this kid at Taco Bell. I said, you're not burned out. He said, how do you know? I said, I don't think you've ever been lit. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. How many ever went through a drive through and heard this? A terribly. Yeah, you go through your favorite drive through and a terribly. You have no idea what they're saying. I'm going to tell you another thing. You go through a drive through restaurant today, do not mess them up. If your order is 928, don't give them 1008. <laughs> you people in payroll, you know what I'm talking about, don't you? Like, you're all on top of this. It's 928. You're going to go with 1008, right? You give them 1008. I had this happen to me. I gave a kid 1008. He went like this. He handed me back three fives. <laughs> I gave him a look and he looked at me, he said that I short you. I said, yeah, I need another five. <laughs> I gave him 1008, he gave me 20. I pulled up to the next window, they had a comment card. They said, how was your service? I said, best service I've ever had.